and the thing about it, this shit happened the next week after that freaky bit. <laughs> Couple days later, man, she texted me on Facebook. Her mama called me off of her phone. Her mama had said, your name Brandy? I said, yes ma'am. So she gonna say, I'm gonna need you to stop talking to my daughter because you too old for my daughter. Well, she gonna ask me how you is. I said, I'm 17. She gonna say, how you think my daughter is? I said, your daughter told me she was 17. She was like, no, my daughter is. When she hit me on my FaceTime, she said that I gotta go cause it's game time. She know I'll be on the road, I can't waste time. But as soon as I get home, then it's playtime. I don't play no games. What, what, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy Brandon here, back at it again with another video, man. Look, today's video, as y'all can see, man, got another story time for you niggas, man. But look, oh, as y'all can see, it's the title, man. <sighs> oh, my nigga almost got set up, man. <laughs> like, it, it shit crazy, bro. Some people are, like I said, bro, I, I already told most of my story times. So, yo, yeah, but... I'm gonna go ahead and tell you niggas how this shit go, man. This shit crazy, bro. Some people already heard this story time, but for the people that did it, man, here y'all go, man. Sit back, relax, you know what I'm saying? Simple. But look, man, I ain't finna hold y'all up, man. Get this video a thousand likes, bro. Oh, y'all, yeah, hold on. Before that, man, I seen y'all, I seen y'all fuck with my story time and all that shit, bro. So I was like, man, damn, these niggas really fuck with my story time. So I was like, man, fuck it, I'm gonna go ahead and get you niggas another. But anyways, let's go ahead and get into this story time, man. Let's go, man. <laughs> when this was, this was last year. And the thing about it, this shit happened the next week after that freaky bit. <laughs> so, one day it was me. My homeboy Devin and my homeboy C, we went to the mall. Oh, uh, we was doing. We had went to go do a public interview. You know what I'm saying? So, man, we got that man. She was the first one. She was with her friend. She was the first one I came up to do the interview. So boom. So, uh, did the interview and all that shit. It was a rate. It was a um rate me one out of ten. I supposed to upload it, but I did. So. I asked her, rate me one out of ten. She said, I'm ten. So, man, bro. Um, a couple days later, man, she texted me on Facebook. <laughs> so, um, you know what I'm saying? We just started texting and all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? We started FaceTiming and shit. And it was just one day, um, I pulled up at her house and all that shit. So, at her house and all that shit. Uh, we was just chilling. We ain't do nothing. We ain't do anything. On God, we ain't do nothing. So, man, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? We were chilling and all that shit. I was talking to her friends and all that shit. Her friends, they were calling me cute and shit. So, um, you know what I'm saying? I left and all that shit. We were just playing and all that shit. I left. And... Next thing you know, man, like, probably, like, the next week, I think it was the next week, I think it was, bro, I, I forgot, I just, bro, bear with me, huh? yeah, I think it was, like, the next week, man, it was just one day, I was so sleepy, so, I was asleep, her mama, her mama called me off of her phone, I got a phone call from her, but it wasn't her, it was her mom. So I answered, you know how you sleep and you woke at the same time and you feel like a dream? So that's what was, that's what was happening to me. So I, I thought it was a dream, you know what I'm saying? I thought this shit wasn't real. So boom, I pick up the phone, her mama asked me. Her mama had said, your name Brandon? I said, um, I said, yes ma'am. So she gonna say, listen here Brandon, I'ma need you, I'ma need you to stop talking to my daughter because you too old for my daughter. I was like, yes, ma'am. Okay. I said, okay, yes, ma'am. And I went back to sleep. 
Next thing you know, man, I woke up, I started feeling funny as hell. I was like, man, what the fuck was that? I was like, was I dreaming? So, um, what I did, I can't, I had got it confused with one of my exes. I got it confused. So I told one of my exes, I was like, oh, uh, I told her, I was like, bro, I had a dream that your mama called me off of your phone and said I was too old for you, bro. And she was like, man, what the fuck my mama? What the fuck my mama go call you to say I'm too old for you for? And I, I, I was just tripping, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, you know what I'm saying? So that same day that I, that I text my ex, I text her. I didn't say, oh, uh, what I said? I said, damn, what I said? I fucking said, what's up? I said, what's up to her? I text her, what's up? Okay, so her mama FaceTime me. She was like, I could have sworn I told you to stop talking to my daughter, to start texting my daughter. She was like, she was like, I can really just call the police on you and all that type shit. So I was like, I was like, oh, I was like, ma'am, I swear I thought that was a dream. She was like, I don't know if you was high or not, but yeah, you need to stop texting my daughter. And she gonna, I said, okay, yes, ma'am. And before we hung up, she gonna tell, she gonna tell me how you is. Well, she gonna ask me how you is. I said, I'm 17. She gonna say, how you think my daughter is? I said, your daughter told me she was 17. She was like, no, my daughter is 13. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. I was like, this girl literally just lied to me about her age, fool. So think about it. She, I wasn't the only one. She was messing with a 19. The girl don't even look like she 13. She don't, that's why I say, bro, that's why I say these girls and so many, I ain't gonna say all girls, but so many girls in Mobile, Alabama, bro. Oh my God, bro. They, I don't know, bro. They on some dumb shit, bro. Like that shit crazy. So, man, bro. So, uh, I told her mama, I said, man, on my dead uncle grave, I did not know your daughter was 13. If I knew your daughter was 13, I would never test her. I don't even rock like that. Like, I, I'm not even like that. She said, um, I don't blame you and all that type stuff or whatever like that. So she gonna, um, she, she was right there. And the thing about it, she was on FaceTime with her. She was on FaceTime with me while her daughter was sitting right next to her. So next thing you know, she gonna, she, her mama gonna ask me, you was over here yesterday, right? I was like, no, ma'am, I was not over there. She gonna, the, I thought, the girl, her mama, let me, let me hold up. So her mama gonna ask me, you was, you was over here yesterday, right? I was like, no, ma'am, I was not over there yesterday. She said I was over there last night and all this. I was like, no, ma'am, I was not over there. Then her mama, her mama gonna say, her, I'm, I ain't gonna say her name, but her name, I'm gonna I'm a name her Kappa. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, oh, did I, did I give her name? We gave her name. I forgot. But anyways, so this how, this how it was, man. So her mama gonna tell her mama gonna ask her. So who was over here last night? And I was like, damn, this bitch really try to set me up. I could have really went to jail. That's why I say God is real, bro. That's why I say God is real. This bitch really set this bitch really try to set me up. I could have really went to jail for this hoe. Not even jail, prison. When you when you bro, some of y'all know, but when it comes to like, like rape or age type shit, bruh, you don't go to jail. Your ass go to prison. So, so I was like, what the fuck? So I was like, oh my God. So I told her mom, I t so me, her mama hung up. She was like, I had to say, okay, thank you for telling me. And her, we hung up. So I had to call her mama back. I was like, ma'am, thank you so much for telling me this because I could I got something going on for myself I got a whole YouTube channel I got something going on in my life and I promise God I did not know your daughter was 13 like she completely lied to me and my my bad y'all I was totally interrupted but anyways uh like I was saying man she completely lied to me bro like Shit, crazy as fuck, man. These females, boy, they will pull some shit, bro. Like, I don't know, boy. 
hate you. Boy, they gonna pull some shit, especially down here. They'll pull some shit on your ass, bro, and they won't give a fuck at all, bro. But I ain't gonna say it. not all females do that shit, but some female, most females, they do that shit, cause real talk. So you better keep your guard up, bro, real talk. But yeah, man, I had to tell her mom, I was like, thank you so much, man, cause I did not know that that girl was 13. Man, that girl, man, I wish I could just, I wish I could just put a pitch up, but I can't even expose the girl like that, know what I'm saying? But, bro, if y'all see that picture, some people already see, because I show her what she look like. I, If you never been in my life and never seen it, yeah, bro, that's you. But most people, they, I showed a picture of it, and I showed people, I was like, bro, do this girl look like she 13? Everybody was saying no, but that girl look at least 16, at least 16. But shit so crazy, bro. These females, they will pull that shit, bro. I'm, I'm trying to tell you, man, that shit pull. Damn, that shit was crazy, bro. That shit was crazy. Like, I could have really went to prison. I could have, but her mama said she not going to call. She not going to call the police on me and all that type shit. I could have went to prison. I could, I wouldn't even be here right now. That, that shit so crazy. That's why I say God is real, boy. On my life, boy. Oh, boy. Like, when I, when we hung up, I blocked her on everything. I blocked her on everything. Phone number, Facebooks. All social media, nigga, no contact with her. None of that shit. You know what I'm saying? But, man, fool. Man, when that shit happened, cuz. Man, when that, that shit with my, uh, with my ex, that freak, and not this. But this made me realize, these bitches ain't shit. These bitches really ain't shit these days. These hoes don't give a fuck. Like, I ain't gonna say all females hoes. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man. But look, man. I hope y'all fuck with this video, man. Get a video on... Um, get a video a thousand likes, bro. If y'all fuck with these story times. I'm gonna keep dropping some more story times. I got a couple more story times. You know what I'm saying? I got some story times I ain't never spoke on. But I'm gonna go ahead and put it out there, man. Y'all like listen to my shit. So, yo. But anyways... I hope y'all like this video. Like I said, give this video a thousand likes, man. And I'm going to come at y'all with another story time. Oh, God, I got y'all, man. But look, man. Follow me on Instagram. Tell me your favorite part on this story time. You know what I'm saying? Tag me in it. Mention me in it. Anything, bro. And I'm going to be posting all this shit. But look, I'm going to fuck with y'all later, man. Y'all have a good day. And yeah, we out of here. Gang. Baby, you got some rich, don't need a nigga that got no chance And she give me head to call me down when I got road rage It's so crazy, I can't even feel my body, she kill good